playing baseball with a group of kids, including her older sister, when a man reportedly stepped out of a white pickup, hit her sister in the head, and grabbed Leslie. Authorities believe the suspect targeted the toddler and that she could be in grave danger. It's been 24 hours since this little girl was taken out of her own front yard. Out to the lines, Kelly in Florida. Hi, Kelly. Hi, how are you? Me and my mom are big fans. Bless you. Thank you for calling in. What's your question, dear? Um, I just had a question. Now, with the other kids in the front yard, have they interviewed or talked to anybody? Or did he attempt to try to get anybody else? Or was he specifically targeting this child? Michael Board, WOAI, what can you tell me? Yes, he specifically targeted this child. In fact, he went away from other kids and ran after this four-year-old girl, pushed down her sister, beat her sister over the head, threw this girl into the bed of his pickup and took off away from the field where they're all So the little baseball. girl tried to run? You said he ran after her? Yes, yeah, he apparently jumped out of the pickup truck, ran after the four-year-old, grabbed her, and when the 12-year-old, like any other sister, sees something happening to their sister, they're, of course, going to go oh. over there, try to help them out. And this guy pushed her away, beat her over the head, tossed the girl into the pickup Got truck, it. and took off. To Dusty in Michigan. Hi, dear. Hi, Nancy. Thank you. Um, I have a question. Uh, it sounds like whoever took this little girl is uh, somebody that's got a grudge against the family. And I'd like to know if that could be a person, a suspect, and somebody that's got something okay, wrong with good the good question. Matthew Zarell, what do we know? Well, we know that investigators continue to look at all possible leads. They continue to investigate. They've got the FBI out there. They've talked to the kids, as you've mentioned. They uh, have ATVs out there. They continue to search. Let's stop and remember Army Specialist Albert Jex, 23, Phoenix, Arizona, killed Iraq, awarded the Bronze Star Purple Heart Combat Action Badge, named after his great uncle, also killed serving his country. Free Spirit loved hunting, fishing, camping, drag racing, his Pontiac GTO. He leaves behind grieving parents Kathleen and Nelson, sisters Nicole and Mackenzie, brother James, Albert Jex, American hero. Thanks to our guests, but especially to you for being with us. And special good night from Boston and Georgia, friends of the show, Jane, Ricky, Helene, and Kelly. Everyone, I'll see you tomorrow night, 8 o'clock. Sure, aren't they beautiful? And until tomorrow night, good night, friend. Coming up at the top of the hour, we're reporting on a startling...